वेलकम टू वेल्स क्विक टिप्स एंड ट्रिक यूट्यूब कुकिंग चैनल एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू गोवन मसाला दैट इज रेचादो मसाला वे वी कैन यूज दिस रेचादो मसाला इन मल्टी पर्पज एंड दैट्स वाई आई एम ट्राइंग टू मेक इट इन क्वान्टिटी एंड देन आई विल शो यू वॉट वी कैन डू आउट ऑफ दिस इन लेटर टू लेटर सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी नीड हंड्रेड ग्राम्स ऑफ कश्मीरी रेड चिली so it is like around in 50 numbers but if you weigh it then it is 100 grams kashmiri red chilli and these are not spicy these are for color okay then second thing what we need is we need like this onion so i have taken like one big onion and this is like one small onion medium you can say so one and a half onions we need and this we are going to roast it on the fire okay then we need a ball of a uh, tamarind okay then we need two tablespoon of cumin seeds okay 40 garlic cloves these are 40 garlic cloves then we need around 5 inches of ginger so if you catch inches then it is like this 1 2 so like this i have counted and it is all 5 inches of ginger okay then we need around like uh, you can use sugar or jaggery so i'll be using jaggery that is 1 tea spoon of jaggery or if you want more than 1 tablespoon of jaggery okay then we need around like turmeric powder which is 1 teaspoon of turmeric powder now here comes the dry masalas so these are like 8 cinnamon sticks 8 cinnamon sticks and so we are taking around uh, peppercorns will be 30 peppercorns black peppercorns is 30 and 15 of this cloves okay then we will be adding around salt that is 1 teaspoon of salt that's it vinegar any vinegar whatever vinegar is available in the market you can add it to grind it to paste no adding water so now if you got the masalas please take a look close by so this is like kashmiri red chilies with a non spicy but it is for color so 50 numbers and 100 grams in weight this is tamarind ball this is cumin 2 tablespoon of cumin This is five inches of uh, ginger. And these are our uh, garlics, which are forty, forty in number. Then this is around thirty of peppercorns and fifteen of cloves, eight of cinnamon sticks. Salt you have to add. and turmeric powder is 1 teaspoon okay so now we will have to grind this so now let's roast this onion so i will roast this onion directly on the flame you can even fry it dry fry it it is like excess water whatever is there is going to come out
So this is how I am going to do this. So if you can hear the sound, like whatever is there, it's opening up. The excess of water or whatever juice is there. So we want this way. Okay. Till that is getting roast. Let's it, let us grind. Now if you want, you can remove this out. If you don't want, you can add whole with this. It's up to you. So now I will be uh, grinding the chilies first uh, in a dry without any, anything wet. Then I will add because it makes it easy. So here is the masala like the chili powder. Now I will add all my other ingredients like tamarind and of course onion also we have to grind so we will have to wait. They are nicely roasted. If you can see, they are roasted nicely. So now I'll put off the gas, let it get cooled down, then we will add this to this. Yeah. So after this, I will add this to our masala. So now we'll add this dry masala also and all the other garlics and ginger and pepper and cloves. Then this onions. Then we'll have add our jaggery powder. This helps as preservative, jaggery powder. Then we'll add salt to taste a little bit and it also helps the masala for preservation. And now we will add our Vinegar. So vinegar is like you check, keep on checking. I am using around one of this to grind it. So if you add more, you can add more. So I am adding this. And uh, no water. Again I am telling you. And let's grind this too. Now, uh, if your mixer is not new and the blades are not sharpened, then you soak the chilies in vinegar and then you can grind it. But uh, my mixer is new, so I am uh, have done that way. So I am going to grind this now. So I am adding now one more to this. So like this I have added two. So here it is. But I am going to uh, grind this more into fine coarse. I want more. So I have basically used uh, a three of this. So of vinegar. So you see uh, while grinding how much you need. And accordingly you all add. So I will be adding now a little bit of more vinegar to this. And grind it because I need it a fine Paste, okay so here is my masala ready okay it is this richado masala is ready so here it is rich in color it will be used for many things Well, I've got it in a lot of quantity. So, uh, 
nice fine paste and I will preserve this and use this for many many purposes. So hope you will enjoy this and coming videos you will see how to add or use this masala. Okay. Thank you so much.